Do it again. <clears throat> I'm Amy and this is Sport and Icons. <laughs> Right, Jordan, good to see you again. Hello, hello. You good? I'm good. I'm good. So, um, it's Friday. You're one week away from your next fight. Yes, let's go. Last last hard session done in the gym with the squad. Um, I've got another red zone style training on Sunday, and that's it. Hard work's done. Now, now you've had a hell of a year, though, haven't you? Oh, it's been, it's been amazing. Uh, tough in some parts, but, like... Activity-wise, I've, I've achieved everything I've kind of set myself out for this year. Fifth fight coming up next week, and yeah, end the year strong. Set us all up for a good good year next year. Did you get any feedback about like um, your last fight? Because uh, that was a class performance and a stoppage to go with it. Yeah, definitely. Look, I, because the fight the, at the stadium was a bit scrappy, I, I got a bit annoyed, although I won. I, it's because I like to be clinical, so like I took my time with the, the one at the arena. Um, and I didn't rush anything. I know people were kind of on the commentary as well. Oh, she needs to pick it up. Well, I was picking it up in my own time because I wanted to show a bit of skill. And then when I seen the opening, I landed a shot and I seen I hurt her. So I just I pounced on it. So yeah, good good performance. Still think lots of things to work on, which we've been working on this camp. Um, but yeah, just excited for next week. And uh, your opponent for next week? Um, do you know what? It's actually been hard getting matched up. I've had opponents they've dropped out. I've had someone else that's fell through. Like it, it has been. A bit rough this one, but we've got someone locked in. Spanish girl, very experienced. Um, she's had six fights. She's got a kickboxing background. Um, watched a little bit of footage of her, so she, she's going to come a little bit of an unorthodox stance, but nothing we haven't prepared for, so yeah. So you're going to end the year with a bang, and the, then the next year you're calling out Katie yeah? <laughs> Steady on you, but listen, we're coming for titles. Big, big performance next week, that's, that's the main aim, focus on that, but then next year... I'm coming for some form of title, whether it's the European, try and get the Commonwealth title approved. Um, we're, we're coming for something, and then if it's the year after that, for maybe try and get in for a world title, then, then so be it. But yeah, I'm coming for some form of title next year. So the plan next year then is uh, quite literally to bring any form of titles to Walls End Boxing Academy? Exactly. We're bringing a strap back. I'd love to fight for an area title, there's just not nobody in this area so it's hard and then you can't fight for a British title because there's not enough females within the category so the next best thing is, is European Commonwealth so we'll, we'll go for that. So are you looking to be fast tracked then? Uh, no, I've look, look this year was all about learning, I'm taking my time, I've still got years in the tank do you know what I mean and I've still got a lot to learn um, I'm a lot less experienced in the game from where a lot of these girls are but I'm a quick learner so I know next year things are probably going to move a little bit quicker um, but I'm still just going to take my time when, when it's the right fights they're there to take so yeah now uh, last time we done the interview on uh, uh, Zoom which I really, I really fucked up that one <laughs> <laughs> but I know what to do in the future now um, I asked how Amy was um, at the very end so I'm going to do it right now how's Amy? she's good you know vibey just working hard and um, putting up all my bullshit during the, the wake up but to be fair I've actually been really good this this camp she's just excited to have a little bit of time out with us and have some nice ground because this year has been tough it feels like I've been in camp the, the full year so we're going to have a nice little bit of downtime as a family for Christmas so we're looking forward to that um, are you all set for Christmas or you're not started yet? No, we have actually made a start. Got a couple of good deals in the Black Friday sales. Um, but yeah, uh, we have actually made a start. Christmas decks are up and uh, we're ready to go. And is uh, Santa Claus all ready for a little one? Oh, absolutely. I can't wait for this year because last year like, she wasn't really aware. She was only like a couple of months. So this year she's, she's going to be into things, ripping things open. So just dead excited. Now we're here in the uh, Wall's End Boxing Academy, which is uh, a class gym. What's it like being here? Because uh, you've been here from the start. Yeah, this is the only gym I've been in as a professional, so it's just, it's vibey. Look at it. Who wouldn't want to be here? Um, got a good squad, and we're putting ourselves on the map. Look, there's some, there's some good fighters in this gym, so it's going to be exciting times next year for, for a lot of us. Um, and I expect that there's going to be some title opportunities, not just for myself, but for quite a few of us in the gym. So it's, it's just going to be good, bounce off each other and get our names out there. Now, your fight's going to be uh, live on Channel 5, or it may be on the uh, YouTube platform. I'm sure, sure that's we find out in time. But either way, do you have tickets left? I do have tickets left, so if anybody wants any, holler at your gal. Um, they have gone very, very quick, but I have got um, a few left, so yeah. Drop us a DM on the Insta, and I'll sort you out. Spot on. Well, Jordan, thanks very much. Anything else you want to add? 
Just as always, a massive thank you to the full team, to my coach, Nick, my um, strength and conditioning coach, Andy, my nutritionist, Pete Bell, the full team of sponsors, like everyone, family, friends, everyone that's coming to support us. Like, honestly, it's been an unbelievable year. And without you, I honestly couldn't do what I do. So just massive thank you to everyone. What on? <laughs>